Hello, this is Nicole with HelpMomRemote.com and I was tagged by Miss Nyla, um, I think it's called the Holly Jolly Holiday Tag. Look y'all, I've been starving for a tag so I was excited to get it. Um, okay, I'm looking down at my phone so if I look down, I'm looking down at the phone to ask, answer the questions. Okay, so number one is favorite Christmas movie. Um, my favorite Christmas movie will be um, the Santa Claus movie I think that's Tim Allen in that movie I think it's like one two I think it's just one and two so those are my favorite movies I could think of right now number two are you on the naughty list or the nice list I would be on both <laughs> um, that's all I can say I'll be on both of this um, show us an embarrassing Christmas card photo now I did have a Christmas photo that I thought was embarrassing but other people are in the photo so I didn't want to um, you know show the fo photo and somebody else in the photo um, but it was a photo of one Christmas I had to been about 16 I think I was about 16 me and my girlfriends went to the flea market on Christmas Day I've been thinking that was a Christmas Day photo and when we was Santa Claus, I think it was like a Santa Claus picture, but we was looking all toe up. It was early in the morning and we were at um taking the Santa Claus picture. So I would think that was my most embarrassing one. But like I say, other people in it and I don't want to show it. Um Have you ever had a white Christmas? I don't know. We live in Chicago, so I don't doubt it. If it if it I don't know. I don't remember. Usually it may not snow on Christmas. It may snow the day after, week before. I don't know. I can't really remember. I'm sure that there, there has been at least one white Christmas, but I can't remember. Um, Where do you usually spend your holiday? I spend my ho Christmas holiday at home. That is one Christmas I want to be at home for the holiday. Other holidays, I don't mind visiting and stuff like that, but Christmas... I want to be at home. Um, play or sing your favorite Christmas song. My favorite Christmas song is, I think that song is by Eartha Kitt. And that's Santa Baby, I Cannot Sing. And I do not know all the words. So, you ain't going to get me on that one. But it's that one. Santa Baby, come into, you know, whatever. Is that the, I'm trying to think, is that the same song? Oh, and the other one is, um, honey, it's cold outside. Do you really want to stay? You know, I'm, I can't sing a bit. Those are, those are two Christmas songs I like. Um, do you open any pres presents on Christmas Eve? Mm, I, think, I think we wait till Christmas Day. Now, me, personally, I open Christmas presents any time. I don't play that wait to Christmas I tell you what I want you get it this is for my husband I tell you what I want you get it and that's that's it so I open it whenever um now I have I'm real but I cannot I do not like surprises so I will sneak and open a present I had um my, I'm trying to think how that happened. My husband had bought me a watch for Christmas. I was telling him that I needed a watch. And I needed a watch that was water, water resistant. You know, because I'm in water a lot. So, he went and got me a watch from Walmart. And he had, had the little bag under the tree. And, you know, it was in the little bag. It had a gift box. So, my son was like, um, he was like, um, Daddy bought you a watch. So, I was like, Really? I was like, where y'all get it from? And he was like, Walmart. I was like, but that wasn't a watch. I knew I didn't want a watch from Walmart. J.C. Penny had a relic watch. And I knew it was good because it was water resistant. <clears throat> and it, all, it was also pretty. Like, really nice. So, what I did was, I, um, my husband, we was in bed. And I got the J.C. Penny sale flyer. You know, that Christmas holiday stuff. And because I wasn't supposed to know he got me a watch. My son told me about it. So I was like, I got in bed. And I was like, oh, I like this watch. This the watch. You know, this the, is this the kind of watch I'm talking about. You know, this is the kind of watch I'm talking about. And he was like, 
he he was like did james tell you i brought you a watch i was like so he knew but it was that was real funny so the next day i'm trying to think we were sitting at the table eating and how did it go i kept saying something about a watch because my son wasn't supposed to tell me but my husband already knew he told me so i was like messing with you know my son and i was like man be nice if i had a watch for christmas and then my son say hmm dad i think they on to us <laughs> But he had already told me, so my husband went and took the watch back and got me the one I wanted. See? Give me what I want. Make me happy. I know y'all like, oh, that's selfish. Whatever. Give me what I want. Um, what is that? Do you open your present on Christmas Eve? I just went all off the subject. Can you name all of Santa's reindeers? Now Dancer, now Prancer, now Donald and Blitzen. Comet and Cupid. That's it. And Rudolph. I don't know how many reindeers we have. I think I just named seven. So no, I don't. I don't know. Um, what holiday tr tradition are you looking forward to most this year? My one of my holiday traditions is I like to watch as many Christmas movies as I can during the holiday. Just just sit back on Sunday is our movie night so even just any night that we all together and we have time to watch a movie before the kids go to bed just throw in a Christmas movie around this time that's my favorite thing to do tradition um okay is your Christmas tree real or fake fake I don't want a real Christmas tree I know they look pretty give me a fake I don't need no thorns in my foot no prickly Give me a fake tree. Um, hands down, what's your all-time favorite holiday food and holiday sweet treat? Holiday food, I would say, is just the whole Christmas dinner. The um, dressing. I don't like turkey. Just give me a chicken or Cornish hens. Dressing, Cornish hens or chicken, greens, macaroni and cheese. My mom makes some bomb potato salad. Um, that's it. That's pretty much all. Now, chitlins. Okay, I grew up on chitlins. Now, I we don't eat pork that often unless we just real bored with chicken and fish. But every now and then, throwing in some chitlins, it don't hurt. So, but I'm not cleaning no chitlins. I'm not cooking no chitlins. So, whoever got chitlins for the holiday, I'm on. So, chit, I love me some chitlins. But I only get to eat them probably every few years. I think once we had some last Thanksgiving. Um, if y'all know what chitlins are, they pig intestines. <laughs> okay. Um, what is your. Oh, okay. And holiday sweet treat. My holiday sweet treat is sweet potato pie. My husband makes some good sweet potato pie. Now, I could make some if I want to, but I don't want to make sweet potato pie. You can't. You do everything, then they don't do nothing. So he makes some good sweet potato pie. I hope my the camera looking kind of fuzzy. I think that's because of the lighting in here. So if y'all hear some cackling, laughing, it's my son downstairs. I don't know what they watching. Um, be honest. Do you like giving gifts or receiving gifts better? I like getting gifts. Um, being that now Christmas is more about my kids, I, you know, it's all about them. So I like giving them. I like getting stuff too, but it's all about them now. Um, show us your tackiest Christmas attire. Ugly sweater. What would you? Okay, ugly sweater. I don't have a. Um, I don't have one of them ugly sweaters for Christmas. I don't, I don't do that. Um. What what would be your dream place to visit for the holiday season? Not really any. I want to be home for the holiday. Um, I really like being home. I don't mind trap, but I like, I mean, even when I go somewhere, I want to be home. So, I want to be home. Does your family have a special holiday recipe you like to help make? No. Mm -mm. Are you a pro present rapper or do you have fail miss do you fail or do you fail miserably i could wrap a gift now 
I'm not into, even though I like to decorate, I ain't into buying all that, all pretty stuff, and you just gonna take it off anyway. No. And then I'll be like, um, give me that paper bag, give me that bow bag. <laughs> but no, nah, I don't. I can wrap a gift, so, but I'm not going into all out on no wrapping paper, spending a whole bunch of money on no wrapping paper that somebody gonna just tear off. Um, most memorable holiday moment. Okay, I'm I'm gonna give y'all the okay. This will be probably the most memorable, and this is gonna probably tie into the next question. The next question is, what made you realize the truth about Santa? Now, one thing made me realize the truth about Santa because whenever you saw Santa, he was going down a chimney. We never had a chimney. We lived in an apartment, so we didn't have a fireplace. And I always wondered, like, say for instance. Your other relatives got a whole bunch of nice stuff, but you got minimal or you just got like Santa like you got favoritism, you know, so I don't know. I just I don't even know if my family, I think they used to just like hide the stuff and, you know, just brought it out. It wasn't like about Santa, Santa, but I don't think I ever believed in him. If he, It's like, hold on, it's my husband. Okay, I'm back. Um, okay. Oh, so I was saying, so I never, like, really believed. I don't remember my parents telling me, like, Santa Claus. I don't, I don't remember that. But anyway, I'm thinking if they did, now I do remember realizing that he wasn't bringing it. I remember one time my, um, I was, we lived in a family building and my grand, my father and my uncle were at my house and I was at my grandma's house, but I came down to our house too early. And when I came in, they were putting together my bike for Christmas. So that was like, oh, they bought me, you know, so I think that was like when I really realized like, oh, that's what they do, you know, but I guess I still don't remember them telling me it was a Santa. I, I can't remember that. Um... Where I'm at, where I'm at. Okay, do you make New Year's resolutions? Do you stick to them? I don't make resolutions. However, I do, like, make goals for the new year. I do plan out, like, certain, that's what I'm in the process of doing now, like, planning out the different things that I have to, you know, dealing with in my life. What, pro you know, what things I want to work on, what needs to be done, you know, all that. I just map it out and try to go towards that. For the new year because I have like a planner I'm like a, I have a planner fetish so I, I have write everything out what I'm gonna do like my blogs and all that kind of stuff personal goals spiritual goals family oriented goals that I want to accomplish that year and like midway through I will go back and look and say okay this I didn't do this I didn't do that or I need to do this that didn't work out so well so I need to revamp that that's what I do I don't do um, the resolutions hold on okay um, and what makes the holidays special for you? Just my family being healthy, um, having a roof over, I mean, just the basic things of life, um, are the things that make my holiday special. Roof, I mean, like, really, <laughs> you know, like, your prayers when you was little, thank God for a roof over my head, food on the table, you know, clothes on my back health I mean that's really what I'm thankful for it ain't all I really all the other stuff is like really irrelevant um even the toys and stuff for the kids is like all that's irrelevant just being able to be home for Christmas like I say having a warm place to stay and healthy those are what makes my holiday special as well as my family all my family okay so um thanks Miss Nyla for this tag I would just tag anybody that's watching it and was like me, like, ooh, I want to get tagged because you do want something else to talk about and also helps you get to know other people you sub to or and, and that are sub to you. So, alrighty, thank you. Happy holiday.